So in we go. Kenny. Well, he hadn't shot himself yet. I wanted to check on you. Make sure you're okay. You know what it feels like to get beaten almost to death. Not good. Peaceful. It feels peaceful. Oh. It was like I was floating away, watching the whole thing happen to me. And then I woke up again, and nothing's changed. I'm still taking a beating. Every day. Duck. Katja. Sarita. No peace. No rest. I know it's hard for everyone, but things will get better. Why the hell couldn't Carver have just finished me off? Obviously, I ain't helping anyone by being here. That's bullshit. That baby's almost here, and Rebecca needs your help. Yeah, I guess she does. See, we do need your help, Kenny. Now, nah, don't worry yourself about this. It's nothing. Hadn't killed me yet, anyway. Don't be stupid. It could be infected. Oh, that's just lovely. Well? Oh, shit. Does that mean what I think it does? What are we supposed to do? Oh, boy. Not good. Not good. We should see what's going on. This baby's gonna be a mess. Really bad. Are you okay? How does it feel? It feels wet. That's how it feels. What's going on? Rebecca's water broke. <sighs> oh, Christ. We should... I don't know what we should do. Oh, fuck. And that means the baby's coming, right? Kenny, thank God. I think the baby's coming. What do we do? All right, all right. Give me a second. No way can Rebecca travel like this. He's right. She's gonna make a lot of noise. They'll be able to smell her, too. Now you got no choice but to lock down and ride it out. What kind of stuff do babies need when they're being born? Kenny, come on, you gotta focus. Right, right, sorry. Clean water for one thing, and blankets. And we gotta get out of this damn cold, too. That map shows a couple of buildings nearby. Maybe one of them could do the trick. And we're gonna make it. The museum seems like it could be a good start. 1.2 miles. Go. Good idea. Mike, think you could go with her? Sure thing. I'll check the building by the river. Okay, then. Kenny, you, uh, you stick with Rebecca, and I will check the perimeter for walkers. Sarah? Sarah, you just stay here with Rebecca and Kenny, okay? Clem. I know it must have been hard, but thank you for talking to Kenny. I'd love for you to give me and Mike a hand looking at the museum, but I was thinking, how do we know Jane ain't just gonna take off? Maybe you should go with her. Make sure she comes back. What do you mean by that? You know, she doesn't seem to like being around people much. And she volunteered to head off awful fast. I guess it could be nothing. I don't know if Jane will come back. I think she's scared about the baby. It's a good point. That's what I was afraid of. That's why it might be a good idea to have you go with her. Just something to think about. Okay, we're looking for warm blankets, clean water, disinfecting. Yeah, we'll go that with Jane. Sound right? Maybe I should go with Jane. Better hurry and catch up then. All right, everyone, you know what to do. Let's be fast and let's be careful. Seemed like the best option. I don't think she's gonna hurt us, but I don't think she'll stick around. Where'd she go? Oh. I think that's her over there. Gonna 
walk really slow. Oh, hey. Are you okay? Yeah. Yeah. Just a lot's happened today. And I don't know if... Well, it's sometimes good to have someone watching your back. Indeed you do. So, come on, partner. Let's go check out that deck. I like the height. Let's go take some dick pics. Partner? Don't let it get to your head. Let's go. I hope this place is what we're looking for. I hope this deck's not God rotting. God so we could use a break. Check this out. This gate's still locked, which means that hopefully no one's gotten to whatever was locked in there in the first place. Who knows what could be in there? That could be a place for Rebecca to have the baby. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Shoot, we could live up here. Hmm, maybe I can pick the lock. The nail file? Versatility is not overrated. Zombies don't walk upstairs, it's perfect. You know, uh, it wouldn't hurt to try a heavier hand with this thing. See if you can find something bigger. We might need to bust the mechanism. Zombies are just like Daleks. They can't handle the stairs. Let's check the trash. Hello! Find anything? No, not even trash. Hmm. I was hoping to find some trash. Back in the days of yore, there was the Civil War. That rhymed. Take a look around. I guess it's broken. And it's probably one of those you have to put change into in order to see anything. This is useful. Ow! Shit! You okay? Yeah. Ah, I think I almost had it. Keep looking. Will do. I guess they're not the ones you put change There's in. There's some buildings across the river. I think I can see a church. The nearest river crossing is miles up. Rebecca wouldn't make it in her condition. Keep it in mind. Though. Jane, there's someone coming toward us. Oh boy. He's got something in his hands, so... Shit, shit, shit. He's coming this way. And who knows if he has friends nearby. Why is he coming up here? No idea. But we should scope him out and see what he's up to. I don't like having some stranger sneaking around so close to the others. We've got enough on our plates with a baby coming. Last thing we need is someone telling their friends about the new easy targets in the neighborhood. I'll distract him so you can sneak up behind him. Good call. He doesn't look like much of a threat. Shit. Hide now. Oh, this is a great hiding spot. Yeah, with that leg, I don't think he's going to be killing anybody. Let's talk to him. Hey. I'm just a kid. Please, don't hurt me. Do you understand me? Yes. Just a scared kid. I'm Arvo. I'm going to go. I don't want to shoot. I don't want to shoot anyone. Especially Malinka Devochka. Uh, uh, little girl. You don't have to shoot anyone. Just put the gun down. <gasps> Back up. Put the bag down. 
Clem, make sure he doesn't have any other weapons in there. No, I have no more guns. I what a medicine. Anything? Whoa. That's a serious stash of meds. No, 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 no. Take whatever you want, but don't take the medicine. It's for my sister. My older sister, she's sick. The pain makes her cry, and that makes those things come. Please. Is it just you and your sister? No. I have many friends. In the woods. Sister or not, we could really use that stuff. No, you are not nice people. You have already left me defenseless, and now you you take my sister's medicine? You are worried. Hey, you need we've it. got people who are suffering, who need this medicine. Luke's still a wreck after Carver's. Kenny's a mess. Rebecca's in pain. Look at all of it. Clementine, we need people that stuff. People are suffering just as much as yours. You are not special. Mm. Clementine, yes? You must we don't believe, believe a me. fucking word about your sick sister. Please don't make my sister suffer. She has been through enough. Oh yeah? Oh, this well, is such I a hard choice. Junkie. You know what that word means, oh, huh? No, I'm. I'm telling the truth. We're gonna leave it. I swear upon my own. I'm life. not a dick. You're not taking them. I'm not robbing anybody. Just let him go. Oh, Thank you, Clementine. Thank you. Have to do this. Just let me go. Jane, what are you doing? Don't you ever come around here again. I don't care if you do have some sick sister. The next time I see you, you won't just be walking away. Go. That may come back to bite me, but you know what? It was the right thing to do. I can't believe I've gotten into this mess. Threatening some stupid kid? I thought we were just gonna talk to him. I needed to make sure he didn't come back here again. Go get the others. I'm gonna get this place opened. Then we need to get moved in ASAP. Probably in the best idea now that they know we're here. Whoever they are. Clem! Clem, hey! Any luck with that observation, Dick? I was just checking on Rebecca and Kenny. They said they hadn't heard from you in a while. I don't guess there'd be much, but Jane seems pretty resourceful. God knows we could use a break. Jane and I were trying to open the gift shop and a stranger showed up. What? Shit. This is the last thing we need right now. Jane took his gun and scared him off. Well, I, uh, I'm glad you're okay. Is Jane still up there now? Yeah, she's trying to get the gift shop opened. You know, I can't figure her out. I mean, she really lays it on the line, but at the same time, she doesn't show you anything that counts. I'm still not sure what to think about her. She's strong, and she's been helping us, but she's cold. Maybe. But nobody's that cold. I'm definitely starting to think we might need to branch out. What do you mean? Jane seems like the kind of person who gets tempered by hardship, you know? But when I look at Kenny now, he just... He seems broken. Broken people get reckless. I know you got a history with him. Look, I think he's a good guy. At least started as a good guy. Are you any better? Is anyone? Whoa, whoa, hold on. I, I didn't mean... We're all crazy. I just want to survive. And that means picking the right sides. There are no right sides in a zombie apocalypse. I need to tell the others about the deck. Yeah, good. I will, uh... I'll see you back there. I'm 
I'm not supposed to be in labor yet, Kenny. What if something's wrong? Nothing's wrong. Babies know how to be born. Clementine. What'd you find? The building around back has an observation deck. Somewhere the baby will be safer? It's coming so much faster than I thought. I told you. You're getting yourself all worked up over nothing. It's high up, so it should be safe from walkers. Sounds good. As soon as Mike and Bonnie are back, we'll go. Hey, Clem. Glad you made it back safe. How are you feeling? Scared. And it hurts. <laughs> I wish Alvin was here. Everything Alvin did was for you and the baby, back at Carver's, in the office. He stayed behind to stop the people chasing us. He died to keep us safe. Jesus. Of course. Of course he did. I know it's a waste of time, but I can't stop thinking about things I should have said to him. Things I should have talked to him about. How am I ever going to do this without him? Alvin told me that he thinks the baby's gonna be a girl. Oh, yeah? That big dummy never did have a sense for these things. I've got a feeling this one's a boy. You're a good kid, Clementine. I'm glad you'll be there to watch out for this baby. Ugh. Oh, shit. I got this. We ain't seen Mike or Bonnie in a while, and I'm not saying I don't trust him, but I'd appreciate it if you went and checked up on him. Yeah, go on ahead. I'll be fine. Let's go take a look. Come on, you can run faster than that. Move! Move, you little girl! Probably should have inspected the area a little bit more. <laughs> 